how the Earth will look in 250 million years. Okay, I'm very excited about this. So this is right now. And look at that. Hang on, hang on. So it's already been 5 million years and we're 11 seconds in. So population of the human race is most likely just extinct or we've moved somewhere else by this point. But because we're traveling so quickly, we can actually see Australia just heading north towards Asia. And meanwhile, whoa! The Horn of Africa has collided with the Middle East. Oh my god. Look at everything go. 30 million years! The Panama Canal has turned into a Panama... Gap. <laughs> hey, write that down. In 32 million years time, I want credit for the Panama Gap. Alright, what else we got? USA and Canada, not too different to be fair. Oh, but Africa is plowing into Europe. 53 million years. So like, I, I mean, I, I'm trying to think at what point does it break something? Do you know what I mean? Because it's happening so ridiculously slowly that I guess all of the houses that are slowly moving right now, I guess they already won't exist before it becomes a problem. I mean, I suppose everything's happening on a bigger scale, isn't it? So it's, it's earthquakes and those sort of things that are going to cause the issues when tectonic plates collide. Oh, Australia's just completely just melting into Asia right now. Very, very interesting. I wonder how, what, how that would impact the climate as well. Right, we're about to reach 100 million years. The Mediterranean's just gone. Oh my god. Oh, and look at Alaska and Russia. It's just breaking apart and off they go. Well, what's up? What's, what's that? What has happened to Antarctica? It looks like old mushroom soup. What on earth is going? It's on a mission. Off he goes. 130 million years. Uh, USA is still looking pretty similar. Yeah, Australia's still on a mad one. Well, I don't know where Antarctica's off, but he's he's gone for it. <laughs> Africa's really ruined some like nice swimming and scuba diving spots in the Mediterranean there, but you know, what can you do? Okay, what's happening in South America? South America as a continent just looks pretty much the same. Uh, the North America is kind of getting mashed up though. And the Pacific has gotten even bigger. Oh my god, 200 million years. That's crazy. Oh, yes! South America and what's that? Is that Africa and the Kaline? And oh my goodness! Antarctica's getting in on it as well. Look at them all heading for each other. Even North America's up for it. Ah, That's the noise I like to imagine that you'd hear as the continents collide, but in actual reality, no one would ever notice and we're probably all dead anyway. Oh my goodness. There we go. 250 million years. That is so interesting. So Pangea breaks apart into lots of little bits and then slowly over 200 million years it all squashes back together again that was epic thank you very much for watching link to tech insider in the description please subscribe to me if you want to see more videos and i'll see you later